Hello, y'all. This is ML Caster with the Redneck Renegade Radio. I'm coming before y'all today because I have a serious message I need to share with you. Some of you may not be aware, but there are some very significant events that are lining up for next week. Some of those events very well could set off a firestorm in our nation. But I'm afraid that some of you here are not aware of those events, and that's why it's my duty to come before you and make you aware of those events. Now, I'm not telling you to take my word for it. I'm asking you to do your own research and then share that information on with others so that you all can be prepared. Okay, here we go. August 11th, for the first time in our nation's history, FEMA and the FCC plan on a nationwide emergency alert test. This is going to be on August 11th. This message will be sent out to TVs, radios, and cell phones. This has never happened before in our nation's history. Why are they doing it all of a sudden? Why is a great question. Because also on August 10th, 11th, and 12th, there's another major event in our nation. It happens to be in Sioux Falls, South Dakota. That event is Mike Lindell's Cyber Symposium during August 10th, 11th, and 12th. Don't you find that interesting that FEMA and the FCC are going to plan an emergency broadcast alert test during Mike, Simpo or, I'm sorry, Mike Lindell's Cyber Symposium during those three days? Why would they be doing that during that time period? Very interesting. There's also another event that's happening on August 11th. It has to deal with Julian Assange. Okay, The head government star witness against Julian Assange has recently come forward and admitted to fabricating his testimony and his accusations against Julian Assange. So on the 11th, Julian Assange has his final day in court where he should be released now that all the charges should be dropped against him because the star witness lied. Why are all these events happening at the same time? Very interesting, don't you think? There's another thing that's possibly happening, allegedly happening, and that is that our illustrious government officials, both Congress and the Senate, are planning on taking an extended recess during this time period. Well, look at everything else that's happening in our nation right now. They're planning on more lockdowns. They're planning on implementing more of those rules and wearing the uh, blankets on our face. They're planning on other events as it relates to the Valvoline. So, folks, I'm asking you, get prepared. Get your homes in order. Get supplies as much as you possibly can because things are coming to a head. You don't think that the deep state and those within the deep state are going to allow these events to go forward next week without trying to interrupt them and try not to allow us patriots and citizens to know what is truly happening. There's major events that are broken loose today in Arizona. Most of you aren't aware of it. Some of you probably are. Some of those events, or some of the, I'm sorry, the events that have transpired, please excuse me, but the events that have transpired today are serious. The Senate for Arizona had petitioned and subpoena the software company that provided the software and voting machines during the 2020 election. All right? That company decided they weren't going to show up. Yet, a whistleblower from that company did show up and testified to their intimate knowledge of what really happened on that day in regards to these hardware and the software provided by this said subpoenaed company. This whistleblower has blown things wide open. Things are heating up, folks. Get prepared. Share this message with as many as you possibly can. I love you. And I want you all to be safe. 
God bless.